Hi friends, today I discuss on equation of motion. So equation of motion is applied for for uniformly accelerated motion means acceleration is constant for this type of motion equation of motion is used so the basic three equation of motion is the first is v equal to u plus a t the second is s equal to u t plus half a t square and the third is v square equal to u square plus 2 a s these three equations sorry for this these three equations are used for determining initial velocity final velocity time taken distance displacement travel or acceleration where u equal to initial velocity v equal to final velocity a equal to acceleration and t equal to time taken and s equal to distance travel by an object distance travel so these three questions are used in used to find or established a relation between u v a s and t so in most of the question or most of the problem four quantities are given or three quantities are given and one is to find one is to be find to need or need to be find so how prove that these relation between this parameter so i prove this these all equations by graphical method in next page now i prove equation of motion by graphical method so this is an uniformly accelerated motion from a to point b from a to point b so first thing i did draw a perpendicular from b point to down so now i prove equation of most first equation of motion first equation of motion first equation of motion so i know that acceleration h acceleration h change in velocity change in velocity upon time taken so if i notice the graph the initial velocity is u which is represented by oa and the final velocity is v final velocity is v and the final velocity is v and the time taking from a to b is t then put the value change in velocity is equal to final velocity minus initial velocity on time so the final velocity is equal to bc 
which is v minus initial velocity ao means bc minus ao so v minus u upon total time is t which is represented as acceleration a now cross multiplying gives at equal to v minus u now if i arrange that then v equal to u plus at the equation first now for the second equation if i find displacement from this graph so the displacement is equal to area enclosed by vt graph and t axis and t axis so the area of this graph is like a trapezium this area and if find that this area this is a trapezium i divide in these two this is a first a triangle adb and a rectangle abco so the area of triangle and plus area of rectangle area of triangle is half into base ad which is equal to time t is a time t t into height this is a height bd if bc is v and ao is u then bd is v minus u so this is v minus u plus area of rectangle length is t into breadth is u so if you solve this and this gives displacement or distance travel so this gives vt minus ut by 2 plus ut so if you solve this so if you seen this s equal to take a common t by 2 v minus u plus ut now if now if i multiply by t and also divide by t then s equal to v minus u by t and t by 2 sorry t square by 2 plus ut and if you know that v minus u by t is equal to a acceleration change in velocity with respect to time so s equal to 1 by 2 at square plus ut this is the equation number second s equal to ut plus half at square so i prove these two equation and continue to third now continue to third equation of motion by same graph same graphical method in second equation proof i can i find the area of this diagram this trapezium o a b d c by by dividing in two figures first is triangle and second is rectangle and find the area of triangle and rectangle just add these two area and find this relation now i again find area of ao cdb trapezium by trapezium formula which is equal to sum of parallel side sum of parallel sides into distance between them into distance 
between them by 2 which is equal to OA plus BC into OC by 2 and area of trapezium is gives distance travel S. Now put the value S equal to OA plus BC. OA is U plus BC is V into OC is P by 2. If you arrange this, if you arrange this for arrange this relation and if I again closely view on acceleration formula which is equal to a equal to v minus u by t the find the value of t t is equal to v minus u by a and put this value of t in this equation then u plus v by 2 into t v minus u by a. This is equal to v square minus u square by 2a. Just cross multiply and find v square equal to u square plus 2as. This is the third equation of motion. So I hope you understand how to prove these equations of motion by graphical method. So I discuss I example in next page. Now I take example, a car accelerates uniformly from 18 km per hour. This means initial velocity u equal to 18 km per hour. I, first I change this unit into SI unit, meter per second. So I find 18 into km, so 1000 by 36 hundred. This is equal to 5 meter second. Now final velocity v equal to 36 kilometer per hour. It's just double the initial velocity, so it's a 10 meter per second. Now the time taken is 5 second. Time taken is 5 second. Sorry for this. 5 second. Now you find the acceleration. So the acceleration is a equal to change in velocity final minus initial by time final is 10 minus 5 by 5 which is equal to 5 by 5 1 meter per second square. This is your answer. And in second you find the distance covered by the car in that time. So if you observe in second equation of motion which is equal to S equal to UT plus half AT square. I find distance travel S. U is 5 times 5 plus half acceleration is 1 times 5 square. So if you solve this, then you find 37.5 meter. So this is your second answer. So I hope you understand how to solve problem on equations of motion and where I apply equation of motion. So please download the Scholar Learning app and if you already download this, then enjoy learning. Thanks to watching this video.